Hey YouTube, it's me, it's your iPhone Captain. Today we're going to be looking at Machinarium. This is a updated version, so I thought I would do a review of it and let you guys know what you got. You can pinch to zoom in here and save some up to six different places to save your game from, game position I should say. It's a... Uh, it's really a, an improvement over it and it is available on the iPhone and the iPad and the iPod and I think it's one it's it's available in the App Store right now for $3.99 if I do have that wrong my link will be correct in the description below and you'll be able to download it there with correct price and everything if you want to check it there but I'm pretty sure it's $3.99 uh, it's probably one of the hardest puzzle games I have ever tried to play. So if you like a challenge, you are definitely going to be digging this. Um, some of these puzzles, I mean, it ta it, it's taken me several uh, different tries and, and all sorts of different things. But it's available for $4.99 in the App Store right now. And you'll see when you first start here, you've got to collect some things that are just right around or within your reach. And when you get the little magnet and that string right there, you have to attach those together above in your inventory before you try to use them. So be sure you do that. Pretty awesome app, guys. Like I said, it's very difficult to play. So if you like a challenge, I think it's really going to be uh, something you'll enjoy. It is easy to get frustrated though, but if you'll watch these introductions like right here, they give you several hints and show you how to get across and complete the puzzle. So be sure to pay attention to all that stuff. I mean, it's there for a reason. And I have done an increase on this and speeded everything up, hoping it will help it play better for you and you get more enjoyment out of it. But you can see right here, you have to climb that little pole to get your light bulb up there. And you have to use those uh, little metal sticks as you go up the pole to go higher. So just keep touching the little robot guy and he'll do what he's supposed to do. And when you get as high as you can go, you, you can reach over there and get your light bulb and he'll fall off. And you'll see right here, uh, you have to put your light bulb in first then you have to have your hat but your hat the cone hat has to be painted and the paint is under all those cones so be sure to flip all those cones over to get your paint and come over here by this barrel you dip your hat and you'll see right here I'm fixing it to dip my hat in the barrel of blue paint now it will allow me to cross so let's get my light bulb in there Now we can get the hat on, the little cone I should say, and once you get everything in the correct order, it just, uh, it works, and you walk over there and, and, and slide your finger upward over your robot to, to extend it, and you'll get the little lever there, pull the lever, and you'll see that the little bridge falls down. You can walk across, but I didn't get all the way across, I don't know if I should have lowered my robot before I crossed the bridge but it ends up knocking me off down into another hole and I've been trying to complete this puzzle down here for a while it's probably uh, I've been fooling around with this probably for 30 minutes or 45 but please hit that subscribe button before you go guys and keep coming back 